video of our multi-video seller series, we should look at commission and how the marketing a seller receives on their home is related to the commission they select to pay. We shall not be looking at the marketing per se in this video, as that is a topic that will be covered in another video later on in our seller series. So here are seven points of note about commission. Number one, no upfront fees. The commission a seller pays on the sale of their home is customarily paid at closing out of the seller's proceeds, which means that there are typically no upfront fees to pay when placing a home on the market. This works well in particular for sellers who may not have a lot of savings at the time they decide they wish to sell their home. If a homeowner lists with our team and the property does not sell in the listing period, then the homeowner does not pay any real estate commission. Number two. Real Estate Commission Commissions vary from real estate office to real estate office. We have already covered in an earlier video that it is illegal for real estate offices to get together and agree to charge one standard commission. This is termed price fixing and is not permitted. Number 3. Free Cancellation Should the homeowner's circumstances change during the listing period, our team offers a free cancellation. Number four, co-brokering commission. The commission charged to a seller by the listing office includes what is called a co-brokering commission. That co-brokering commission is what the listing office will pay to the real estate office of the buyer's agent. The agent who brings the buyer to the home, presents the buyer's offer, and then takes care of the buyer's side of the transaction from contract to close. Unlike in other countries, in the US, homes are listed on the multiple listing system, MLS, offering a co-brokering commission to a buyer's agent. We shall be covering the MLS in greater detail in a later video in this series. Number five, representing both the seller and the buyer. If the listing agent is also the agent who brings the buyer to the home, presents the buyer's offer, and then takes care of the buyer's side of the transaction from contract to close, then the listing agent's office will also keep the buyer's agent's side of the commission. Here, in the state of Florida, at the time of making this video, a real estate agent acts as a transaction agent during a transaction unless they are asked by the party that they are representing to transition into being a single agent. Being a transaction agent enables the agent to represent both the seller and the buyer should the listing agent find a ready, willing and able buyer. The agent will then work in the best interest of both the buyer and the seller, representing both parties fairly and preserving all confidences. Number 6. Flat fee commission. Commissions are generally a percentage of the sales price achieved. Occasionally, a commission may be a flat fee and this is more commonly seen when the real estate sale is expected to fetch a low price, such as in the sale of a small lot of land or a low-priced condominium. So how does commission relate to marketing, you may well ask? Number 7. Tiered Commission At the time of making this video, we are quite unique as a team in that we permit our sellers to select the commission that they wish to pay based on the marketing package that they select to be put into action on their home. Our marketing is very professional and diverse, as we recognize that the wider the net that is cast, the greater the number of buyers we shall have coming to view the home. More buyer viewings will mean more offers and in turn more likelihood of achieving top dollar for a seller's home. We go over the marketing packages in great detail prior to listing a home for sale. We feel that handling the commission in this way places the seller in the driving seat and in control of the marketing they receive on their home. All the marketing items are categorized so our sellers know at the time of listing what marketing tools will be put into use to help sell their home. Thanks for watching and make sure to check out the rest of the videos in this seller series.